A prop respiratory therapist will have set you up with all the necessary equipment. This video is a visual review of how to complete the technique of breath stacking or lung volume recruitment via an Ambu bag. This technique is a great maintenance tool for the lungs and is often used to help improve lung function by opening all areas of the lungs. With any level of shallow breathing, the smaller airways or deeper levels of the lungs tend to close. This creates less surface area for the oxygen to get into the blood and carbon dioxide to come out of the blood and be exhaled. This technique helps to take a larger breath by pumping in more air rather than relying on weakened chest wall muscles to pull in air. The Ambu bag is a manual resuscitator commonly used in medical settings. It consists of a self-inflating bag, a one-way valve, and either a mouthpiece with nose clips or a mask. The self-inflating bag allows you to provide breaths by squeezing and releasing. The valve system helps control the flow of air. First, attach the one-way valve to the bag. Next, attach the flex tubing, followed by the mouthpiece. For mask use, first attach the one-way valve, followed by the mask. The best position for this procedure is a comfortable semi-upright position. First, we'll look at the mouthpiece technique and we'll use my friend Elise to demonstrate. This technique can be performed alone depending on arm strength and dexterity. To create a tight seal, insert the mouthpiece between the teeth and the lips. Keep a tight seal around the lips so that no air escapes around the mouthpiece. Nose clips will also help eliminate any air escaping through the nose, allowing the air to enter into the lungs. Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to get you to put the nose clips on. You're going to make a nice tight seal around the mouthpiece. And then we're going to try stacking three breaths in a row. So I'm going to count you in. We're going to go one, two, three. And on three, I'll get you to breathe in. Hold your breath between each breath. So it's going to sound like this. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And then I'll get you to hold your breath for about 10 seconds or as long as you can, and then you can exhale. Don't breathe out in between. You're gonna breathe in and hold all the way until the very end of the three breaths. Everything sound, sound good? Yeah. Okay, awesome. So go ahead and put your nose clips on. So in between your teeth and your lips, make a nice tight seal, okay? On three each time. So one, two, three, hold. One, two, three, hold. One, two, three. And if you can hold for 10 seconds, whenever you're ready, just take out the mouthpiece and breathe out. It may be helpful to start with only one or two breaths and work your way up to a larger volume as you become comfortable and proficient with this technique. Remember, the goal is to deliver a larger volume than you can inhale on your own. The mask interface is very similar but will require assistance. It will work best if you have a headrest to support the back of your head while holding the mask on the face for a tight seal. Follow the same steps as those mentioned for mouthpiece. Squeeze the bag slowly for a deep breath. Hold your breath and stack another breath on top of the first. Continue to stack breaths, pausing briefly between each one until the lungs are completely full. Hold the breath for up to 10 seconds. Remove the mask and exhale. This technique takes practice and coordination, so don't be discouraged if you're unable to complete the first time you try. Make sure you're communicating with your member throughout. Please see the other video for how to use the Ambu Bagger for assisting with cough. Prop is always available by phone during business hours to answer any questions.